In this video, I show you how to add text behind a video in CapCut. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like. And now let's go and jump straight into this guide. Here we are on CapCut and the first thing you need to do is go and tap on the create new project button. Then what you need to do is go and select the video which you want to go and add the text behind the image in the video. So I'm gonna go and do that now. So here we are, I just went and created this CapCut project. And as you can see, here I am. And this is the video which I want to go and add text behind, I want to sort of add it behind my head. So the first thing you want to do is make sure the cursor is at the start of the video, just like this, and then go and tap on text. Make sure the video isn't selected to so tap on that back button if it is. Then go and tap on text, just like so, and then tap on add text. Now what we can do is type something in. So I'm just gonna go and type in uh, my name, which is Tucker, so T-U-C-K-E-R, just like so. Then what I'm going to do is just tap on the font and use a custom font I have on my phone called Cool Vetica, um, and then go and tap on the tick button. Then I'm gonna make this slightly bigger by pinching it just like so, just so it's about this size here. And then what I want to do is place it here. So now what you need to do is place the text where you want it to be behind you. So in this case, I want it to be behind my head like so. Then once you've got it in the right position, you may want to go and add like an animation. So to then what to do that, all you need to do is go and tap on the text in your preview like so, tap on it once and you can go and edit it again. But what you want to do is tap on animation and what I'm going to do is just add a fade in like so and then you can add a fade out as well if you'd like and you can go and adjust the length of that so I might make it slightly shorter just like so then you can go and tap on the tick on the right hand side and that's going to be saved and then what you need to do is make the text um, the length you want it to be so I want it to be the, for the full video like this so I'll drag it all the way out to the end like so now that you've done that, you will now want to go and tap on the export button in the top right of CapCut because we need to go and save this. Do keep watching, it's all going to make sense. Tap on the export button in the top right, the arrow pointing upwards, and it's now saying exporting. And now just go and wait for it to finish, and it's now finished. So now what we need to do is go and press done in the top right like so. And the next thing you need to do is go and tap on new project and you need to go and select the video that you just exported. So tap on new project and select it. Here is the video that I just exported. As you can see, it's now in a new project. Now what we need to do is go and overlay the original video. So the video that we just added the text to and then go and tap on overlay. But just before you do that, make sure the cursor is right at the start of the video because the two videos that we're going to overlay need to align perfectly. So as you can see, it's right at the start and make sure you go and select that original video just like I did there and as you can see the video that I just overlaid hasn't got the text which is really important but it's a little bit small so to go and line it up all you need to do is go and pinch on the video preview screen on the video like so and it's gonna have a white outline once it's perfectly aligned just like so now what we need to do is go and remove the background of the overlaid video and I'll show you how to do that now so scroll along like so and go and tap on cutout so just make sure you've got that overlay layer selected like so then scroll along and go and tap on cutout then you can go and tap on remove background like so and then you can go and tap on the tick on the right hand side like this and as you can see it now says remove background at the minute it's on two two percent five percent just wait for this to finish and then it will complete and i'll say background removed and now if we play the video as you can see it's gone and removed it and you can now see i've gone and overlaid the video over the text just like so and that's literally it guys that looks really really cool and it's that easy as you can see as i move my head it keeps it all uh, perfect and then that's it you can now go and continue editing your video um, and add more clips and do whatever you want with it if you guys found this useful please leave a like peace